Got a special dog here today. I got my buddy Carew. And uh, what a rock star this guy is, I'll tell you. He's an amazing fella. We're having a great day today, boy. She's nice out. We're up high. We're on the rim trail. And uh, we're just enjoying ourselves. Now, I'm going to see if I can turn so you can see this guy more. Let's, uh, let's see if we can do that. Hey, Carew. How about I come here? You come here. Come right by me here. Yeah, this is better group. Let me stay right here by me. Right. Um, yeah, I want you to be looking this way. <laughs> let's, uh, let's try that again. Come, turn this way. There we go. There's my boy. There's my boy. Glad. That's my big fella. That's my big boy. So, what a great dog. Oh, my God. Now, spring bear season, so I don't let Carew roam on his own much. But he's so skilled on the long lead that it's a dream dog to work with. He responds instantly. He's just a dream dog to work with. And uh, he's so polite and so focused and, and pays attention, watches everything. He's just an incredible dog. This is one of the best Norwegian outcound males in the world. And uh, he's, uh, um, he's right at the top, uh, probably one of the very best, if not the best, in North America. His buddy Mon is uh, right up there with him. But uh, this is an incredible uh, stud dog, this guy. Now, uh, we got about uh, 20 degrees today. It's cooler now on this side of the mountain. We're on the on the cool side now. Sun's setting, so we're uh, it's late in the day. We're at about uh, four o'clock right now, and we're having a wonderful hike. We had some water back on the trail there. All the springs are full. Now I raise elk hounds, and uh, this is one of the premier stud dogs, and we've got daughters of his that are uh, going to be cycling soon. We've got females for him, so he'll be breeding again soon. And his uh, his first little pup's on the ground. Well, uh, grandpa, grandpa is on the ground. Uh, Korea's got a, a really fantastic male. And, uh, she was able to keep it through all the stuff, and so she's got a male. And I just took Rita to meet up with Linda. There might be some wind noise. I couldn't get out of the wind. This, these updrafts and the current changes and the temperature change. She, she could be howling. But uh, it'd be just gusts. And so I took Rita to meet Linda yesterday. And so she's down with Pretty Boy Leaf right now. And that's a daughter of Carew and Kai. And a uh, phenomenal daughter. So she'll be getting bred to Pretty Boy Leaf. And that's coming up right away. She'll cycle in the next couple of days. Like, she's starting already. Turn this way, buddy. That's my boy. Go ahead. Go ahead. So, Carew, he comes out of Finland. He's out of Finland. And uh, Kari was the breeder over in Finland. And way to go, Kari. This is uh, an amazing dog. And Satu and uh, Mika brought, brought Karu over. And Satu, thank you for helping me with this dog, I'll tell you. It's an amazing fella. This is the first time this bloodline has, has been in North America. <laughs> this, is, this is a profound dog, yeah. He's out of northern Finland in the Kralian district. Pure hunt dog, and he, he's hunting steady. His whole world is hunting. And so, very, very good dog, but so social, so focused, so handler focused. Um, one of the best handler focused dogs I got. Just lives to be right here. And uh, just an incredible guy. Just a phenomenal dog to get a pup out of. And if you get one of the pups out of this guy or one of his daughters, oh my God, you really got yourself an elk on, let me tell you. Now, these are, these are genetically superior dogs because they're extremely diverse. And so, as this dog is the very first time this bloodline's been in North America, 
made it to all my old world girls there that are all diverse as well, you get an extremely healthy dog. And diverse genetics are, are far superior. They're healthier. And there's traits in here that are nowhere else. You know, they're, they're phenomenal hunt uh, capabilities and they've been preserving them for thousands of years. And this particular dog is an example of everything that you could wish for in an elk hunt. And uh, phenomenal uh, stamina and endurance and agility. It's, uh, his nose is just, oh, it's incredible. I was pretty sure back there he was, uh, he was pretty riled up. I, I don't know if he thought there was a big cat up on the ridge because the big cats are out right now up here. But uh, he thought he better get up there. And so he was thinking he should go. And he watches everything. He's just whatever's moving, he's on it. But uh, that cat smells a little different, so it riled him up a little. Uh, he don't get riled over bears. He's just calm, easy going, and uh, has no problem with them. You just stay. Come in the video. Hey, good, good. You just stay in the video. That's my boy. That's my boy. That's my big fella. Jesus, a good dog. I'll tell you. Yeah, so Crew is starting to stay with me. He'll run with me, Mon, probably Tico. Um, we might set Tico down somewhere, but uh, uh, Crew and Mon will run with me and uh, we'll do the mountain trails and I'll travel around with these boys doing some, uh, like we'll take them to where the females are that are in heat. So we'll be doing some cruising. But uh, this is a world class dog to travel with, no doubt about it. And so easy going, so handler focused, so easy to travel with. Uh, uh, and what a camping dog. Oh my god. Good camping dog boy. Look at him. Oh, air scenting just steady. You can see them air scenting all day long. Yeah, he's really something. Phenomenal fella. Just don't be pulling on that. Hey. Not quite close enough that he can water that tree, so I should move a little. That's okay. Yeah, on, no, Bella. You just stay right here. Perk. That's my boy. That's my boy. That's my boy. That's my boy. Jason's what a good boy. You're such a fantastic fella. Yeah, so we're excited. We got almost all the females placed. And uh, really happy with the way things went to get them all placed. That's so cool. And now I'm up here hiking and doing my thing and getting ready and getting the yard ready for sale. And it's, it's fun. Everything's good. So, yeah. Uh, the fresh air has helped a lot. The snow leaving is a, a big deal for me. And so we're up on high mountain elevations now, going like crazy. Lots of water up here. Good going. And uh, this, the, the dogs that I'm traveling with, of course, are in my opinion, two of the very best males there is, and so pretty lucky to have them. Mon's got a little issue. I'm going to get him in and get him checked out here, but uh, um, nothing, no big deal. And Peru, he's just uh, happy to go anytime I want, so that's good. Tico, he wants to go every day, so I'm out with him all the time. And uh, these boys are fast moving, so I can get a couple hikes in a day. But uh, Peru's just my buddy, no doubt about it. And crew is trouble free, you know, he doesn't uh, cause you any, any issues. He can meet and greet people, meet and greet dogs. He's just a real nice fella. And uh, this is an excellent dog to get a pup out of for a family. Now, Rita's down in Montana, so that daughter of his down there is a dream dog and she'll be hooking up with Pretty Boy Leaf. So those pups will be in Montana. We've got uh, lots of dogs now in Montana. I sent uh, Silver Nessa and Kaliva down to Chris and Tammy, and they're they're down there. They're already at, uh, in their place. Um, the girls, uh, Tuva and Tiara, are already placed way down. Uh, they're they're set up. Um, they're hiking in the, in the high country around Arizona. Geez, they're loving life down there. Yeah, and then uh, Telu's heading down right away. Melanie's coming up and Telu's going down there. So that's that's starting to be pretty cool. Crew, he blew most of his coat, but he got 
little little tufts that didn't come out. But uh, he'll blow a little more in a bit. But uh, so yeah, we got uh, Rennie's got Riata. That she's down in Texas there with the two big boys, Zary and Rush. Um, I hear from them lots. Dixie's there. They they've got some great dogs down there. Oh, it's it's a fun. Raven's heading out soon. She's heading down there. Um, it it's really just a fun time. There's dogs heading out all over the place. So yeah. Um, I'm really happy with things and uh, Michael he's got a real nice group of dogs up there Dale and Wendy got some incredible dogs over there of course and um, Caroline's got that beauty queen cast out in Ontario it's it, things are just they couldn't be better got all the dogs placed in diverse areas and uh, it's it's really quite good um, we got uh, two of the two of the dogs down in southern Alberta there, and uh, those two those two beauty queens are are young yet, but uh, incredible dogs there. So that's that's really really cool. Luke's got uh, his family training that beauty queen they got, and and uh, yeah, it's it's just going to be fun. So we're we're excited about how things have been going, and. Uh, I'm just trying to keep old crew on the trails these days and keep him in shape, keep him moving. He's got good condition. He come through the winter good. So, yeah, phenomenal big fella. Let's turn for the camera. Yeah, oh, that's okay. How about I can bring you around here? Come around here. Sit up this way. There's my boy. Now they can see you. Now they can see you. Now they can see you. That's my good boy. <laughs> Look over this thing. <laughs> Go. That's my boy. Yeah. What a fantastic dog. Oh my god, he's a good boy. <laughs> yeah, this is a real elk out, I'll tell you. Really. He's so focused. He's such a good boy. Yeah, you build a bond with these guys, you really got a dog. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Good boy, Jason. Hey, buddy. Huh? Yeah. Well, we'll get you hiking again. Get you moving down the trail. This is a perfect elk hound head. I mean, you, you can't improve on it. It's the best. His whole, everything about him is perfect. You couldn't improve. So, yeah, he's really something. Where's your lead here, buddy? There we go. Good. Good. <laughs> yeah. yeah, what a good boy. All right, buddy. Let's do it. Let's do it. That's right. That's right. <laughs> good boy. Good boy. Yeah, you're a good boy, crew. What a fantastic dog. Hang on, buddy. I'll just put this down. Hang on. Yeah. I'll show you where we are again on this trail. So we come that, that way. And uh, we hike all along the edge of the mountain here. We're right on the edge here. We look out over the mountains here. It's really a stunning view. We look out over the whole range. And we can see way over to the way. I don't know if you'll see the snow caps, but and then we got this whole ridge to follow. Really a nice trail. So yeah, pretty cool. It's cool on this side because the sun has went over the top. Yeah. So we're going to head back this way. we got water coming out of the side of the mountain back there. And uh, crew, he likes to stop there and have a drink. He's a happy camper, this boy. Phenomenal fella. All right, crew. <laughs> 